All right, this is Tori DeGroat. Thanks for checking out my blog, Blue Beam and Burgers. I'm gonna go over the batch sign and seal here real quick for Blue Beam 2017. And the batch sign and seal is, what that's gonna do is gonna allow you to apply a digital signature and stamp to uh, a whole set of files. So I'm gonna open up my documents here. And I'm gonna go to batch. Now this is in the extreme version only. Um, I'm going to go to batch sign and seal here. So I've got mine selected here. Let's say next. And I've already loaded my digital signature, put in the password. I'm putting a little note in here uh, why they have some comments preloaded on why I'm signing it. Uh, I'm choosing to flatten it and include the date. So when I stamp it, it's going to give me today's date in that format and that font. And then I also pulled in, I imported a stamp, so you can pull in those as well. And I'm choosing to flatten that one also. So it places those on my sheet, and I can go ahead and grab those, place them in my little square over here, and hopefully uh, you should be able to get this you know, within the parameters of the requirements there by state. I know they like to have them exactly is the right size. I'm just going to shrink my signature a little bit. I'm going to place that image on top of my stamp there and then all I need to do is hit done. That's going to jump through all those drawings and place the stamp and the signature in the same place in the same box. So now you can click through these drawings very quickly. It's actually in the same spot as I click through my drawings. That is the batch sign and seal. Again, thanks for checking out Bluebeam and Burgers.